So there will be lots of breaks in the action. We will have lots of insanity in this whole affair, but that's okay. That's what graduate school is about. Um, one of the things that's, that's, that it has been brought up, is being discussed now, is the issue of gun access, right? Availability of guns. And very provocatively, um, some very big names in the field of public health have recently said that the accessibility of guns is in fact a public health issue, right? That it is a pu that, that the availability of, of weapons uh, in the United States, again, it's whether it's a Second Amendment constitutional issue, that's separate. That's for political scientists and lawyers to deal with. We're here dealing more in sociologists and thinking about public health issues. How would you, how would you, anyone, sort of conceptualize availability of guns as a public health issue? Even if you think it's not, that's, that's what we're here to do. I don't want anybody to agree with everybody. What, how do we conceptualize the availability of guns in the United States as a public health issue? Leading to people dying. And Speak loud. Open, so, unrestricted access to guns is leading to a bunch of people getting killed, arguably. Okay. They can be used tools as, you know, to kill. Okay. Um, no? What would be um, what would be something that we have already in American society pretty much determined is a, a, an available product, a legally available product that is a public health issue? Cigarettes. Cigarettes, right? So cigarettes, we determined a long time ago, is a public health issue, but we continue to make cigarettes available legally in the United States. What is the distinction between guns and cigarettes from a public health standpoint? Is there any distinction? Guns hurt other people, cigarettes don't hurt the person you smoke. Well, unless you count secondhand smoke, but. Yeah, 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 that's, the, so, so where were you going with it at first? Forget secondhand smoke, because that is a, con, that's, who knows? It's whatever. So what is it, what do you think is the distinction between guns and cigarettes? Guns. You can use a gun to hurt someone else, but cigarettes are just going to hurt you. Interesting, right? So you could make the argument that it's almost guns are more of a public health issue, right? And I, and I have actually heard that argument made because a cigarette. I don't agree with it. But no. I'm just throwing it out there. So you don't agree that guns are a public health issue? No. Okay, why? I mean, there's no right or wrong. This is a debate. This well, is an open debate. Like anything else, there are tools that if you put it in, if you, I mean, a tool in and of itself is, it's not, it's inanimate, right? Um, you could make the same argument that you're, that they're trying to make about guns for almost anything. It's just that guns are high profile right now. Okay. So I think um, AK-47s or whatever are designed to kill people, whereas a hammer isn't necessarily designed to kill someone. You could kill someone with a hammer, but that wasn't its design. Comes down to also uh, people's intentions, you know. So going back to cigarette, you know, you can smoke a, you know, you can smoke a cigarette. You're not intentionally, you know, trying to kill other people. I, I guess if that makes sense, the access to that availability. It's yeah. easier with guns. Good point. I hate to break up the conversation, but I hate, I hate to make you fake, but speak louder so, so that they can. I'm going to go over there. 